We're here at the Hershey RV show. And one of the best parts about this show is that there's 1500 RVs. But not only that, there is hundreds of vendors in this show selling parts, accessories, kayaks, e-bikes, RV toilet treatment, everything. So what we're doing is we teamed up with some of our sponsors, some things that aren't sponsors that we just think are cool in the show, and some of the things that General RV is representing in this video. And we're just gonna take you on a tour and don't worry, every company that we're showcasing in this video, we will link down below, even liquefy our black tank treatment. Nice. Let's take a look at some of these awesome vendors. We're with Corbin with Blue Technology. Welcome back to the show. Yeah, thanks, Matt. Appreciate and it. And thank you for partnering with General RV. Yeah, it's been so, a pleasure. So what are you selling today? So this year we're introducing a bunch of new cool stuff. Um, with the focus on drinking water, um, Blue Technology has taken an effort upon itself to put everything in stainless. Okay. So this year we're offer, uh, exhibiting a new three-way splitter that's all stainless and okay. stainless known by the FDA and the NSF is drinking water safe. So good. All of our products, including all the internals of our hoses, um, is going stainless. Um, we're also debuting a new stainless steel regulator. Okay. All internal components, all stainless. And then the big introduction is really twofold. Um, this is our adventure series. So last year in the back, if you see Matt, that was our uh, R series. Okay. And this year we're offering our adventure series, which is made out of aluminum and it's about two pounds lighter and about an inch and a half narrower. Perfect. And for people that don't know, what is that? This is a three-stage water filtration system. Nice, um, nice. The magic of it over the, the other systems, um, you'll see your standard inlines. They're 20 microns. This has this is loaded with a 0.2 micron, which is 100 times smaller. It can take out 100 times smaller contaminants. Nice. So it's really safe for all the nasty potential things that make you sick in the water. Um, and we also couple it up with a tasty filter to deal with the smell and taste that you experience in yep. an RV. So that takes care of that. Yep. And then upstream, we've got a five micron sediment to help take out all the larger particles, iron and such to protect the other filters. And how important is all of this when people are camping? It's very important. I mean, the EPA does regulate most municipalities, Okay. Um, but we do know there's a lot of boil alerts. If you watch our, our site, we've got 50 boil alerts a day. Yep. Um, well water, which most of the campgrounds on mm. are not regulated. Yep. And uh, we do have options where you can pull from a lake or stream with some of our off-grid products. Nice. Yeah. Well, make sure you guys stop by, talk to Corbin, talk to the team at General RV and everybody here at this display. And thank you again for yeah, joining us. Appreciate it. All right. Next up is Wayne Wells. What's going on, Wayne, from Liquid Spring? Matt, we have some new stuff going on with our suspension. We are now offering earth, true earth leveling with our suspension system. Now, first and foremost, Wayne, I've been trying to come to the, come see you at the show all weekend, and you guys have just been slammed at this booth. Why is that? Tell us about the new earth leveling. So we, we've been really busy talking about our just our normal product, but the new earth leveling will allow you to level your coach with our suspension. No longer needed would be putting the leveling jacks down in dirt, mud. If you're on a good surface, leveling jacks are perfect. Perfect, But Got if it. you're if you're on something that's way out of kilter or soft, hard to get level on, our system will do it. We can level. Sand, going beachfront. We can do seven inches of, of out of level and still get it leveled. Now, does this work with existing liquid spraying? It does. We, we, will, we will have a retrofit kit, but starting the next month or two, every every RV kit will have true earth leveling. You'll get a new driver interface with it, okay, which is going to give you some diagnostics and a little more ability to do things with your suspension than we've had in the past. Um, it's still going to work the same. It's just giving us, us and you a little bit more uh, information back and forth between our systems. And the only other question I have, do you need to have liquid spring to get the earth leveling? Yes. Okay. It's part of our suspension. Perfect. Absolutely love that. Thank you so much. If you guys are interested in learning more, turn that around, sir. Go to liquidspring.com. Scan this QR code right there if I can get it in focus. Give them a call or give Wayne Wells a call. Perfect. Thank you. Matt, thank you very much, buddy. Appreciate you. General represents five different brands, but there's two brands that we're gonna show you here at the show that represents themselves. First brand, Liquefied, Matt's RV Reviews. And then the second brand is RV Life. You don't have a dealership group because you don't need one, you're just an app. 
we're more than just an app. We are a full-fledged suite of products uh, or suite of software that will help you navigate your trip, plan your trip, uh, create that perfect RV trip, find RV parks, campgrounds, national parks, all those types of things, and get there with an RV safe route and then navigate it on your phone. So first and foremost, if you're coming to the show, stop by this booth, stop by this tent, talk with Patrick, talk with somebody about RV Life Pro. It is truthfully the best app, the best software in the industry. And if you're not making it to the show, you can get a free one week trial uh, and 25% off by clicking the link down below and using promo code Matt's RV Reviews. But Pat, give us, there's so much to talk about. But somebody who's watching this video, give us like a two minute reason why somebody w is gonna wanna try that free seven day trial. Well, you wanna, sit down and, and plan a route you know one of the things we see a lot of new rvers do is they just assume they can hop on the road and go somewhere yes. and you can't you're not going to drive as far as you think you are you're not going to get there as quickly as you think you are and by planning the route on our browser-based tool we call rv life trip wizard which is part of rv life pro you can create that trip safely and carefully and properly vet it out with satellite view street view all the goodies and then when you're ready to go just Pull up the RV Life mobile app, find the trip that you've created, hit go, and match that trip exactly, and use that for your RV safe navigation. This is why I love the Hershey RV show, because you have all these vendors, all these great products out there. And then just so you guys know, there's a whole suite. There's RV Life Campgrounds, Trip Wizard, RV Safe GPS, RV Life Maintenance, RV Life Masterclass. So let's get started. Pat, anything else you want to say to the people? We're downstairs in the Hershey Center, or the or Giant Center in the hockey rink. We've got a double booth, plenty of room. Yeah. We can demonstrate, we can talk about uh, how to utilize certain features if you've used it before and have questions or problems. Uh, if you've never seen us before, we can introduce you to the product. And, uh, you know, and you're doing ready. classes every day, right? Right, so we actually have an RV trip planning seminar daily in some room up here our podcast host dan and patty hunt from the rv life podcast yes. are giving a trip planning seminar each day uh and then down here i'll have a whole team available to just explain products and points and questions and nuance and things you might have about it i love it thank you again so much for joining us all right now guys we are over at the general rv parts and accessories display i say parts but it's really just like fun rv accessories at least in this stand outside so they have a lot of uh lawn games out here we have cornhole um they have a little i think this is funny like beer yeah pong that is game. funny so if you're camping outside your rv and you want to play beer pong you don't need a whole table set up apparently uh, we have Big Connect Four, and then they also have um, a bunch of different like small Weber grills, easy to kind of stow and take with you in your RV, which is really nice. Um, these are some of the long games that I was talking about. So the brand is called Elikai, I think it's how it's pronounced. Hmm. And when I was in the Giant Center, I saw that they they have a whole display as well. Um, but General RV is representing them at the show. If you guys are into outdoor cooking, lots of like really nice accessories here, grill scrubbers and stuff. Um, so definitely make sure. Oh, one thing I want to show over here too. And to ride up to your car. This is something that I've actually been wanting for a long time. So I don't know if we'll be picking it up here at the show, but if you guys have wanted a solo show, if you haven't heard of it, it's like a smokeless uh, fire pit that you can take with you. Um, super cool if you don't want all that like camping smoke right. smell on your clothes and stuff every time you do a fire. So Matt, it was a funny story, Matt actually bought us one of these as a Christmas present last year and he thought he was getting us the big one and right. he actually got us like the little tiny yeah. tabletop one. But I kind of like this like if you don't want to buy the whole Oh for cause sure. Because it, it is a little bit big to like take with you on the road if you don't have a lot of storage. You can get like a little tabletop one. They have these table games, tons of fun stuff to sit around by the fire and play games. And also a bunch of different like collapsible fans and everything to have outside. So if you guys are just looking for fun, this is also like, I feel like a great area for gifts. If you right. know other RVers in your life and you're trying to start getting early on your Christmas presents, definitely come by. We are in the like outside general RV display. That's right kind of out in front of the giant center. So um, if you guys are coming uh, for the last day of the show tomorrow, make sure you stop on by and get some um, good stocking stuffers and gifts for the RVer in your life. All right, so we're here with Janice from, what is your company name, JLF Adventures? Yes. Tell us a little bit about yourself and what you do. So I'm Janice with JLF Adventures. Started the company in 2017. We're based in Michigan. We make inflatable stand-up paddleboards, 
kayaks, swim wraps, and also party lunch. I love this. So, just so you guys know, they are not a sponsor of the show. We actually just met like three minutes ago, but I've been walking by this the whole show. And when nobody was around, I'm like, I can't believe this is inflatable. Like you can kind of feel it, but still it feels super hard, sturdy, and durable. So what, what are you doing different from the competition? Well, did you see that this inflated? When you deflate it, it's right here. Oh, so make sure that's you the two. That's the 15. That's wow. really compact. That's why I love this show because like, because this isn't an RV thing, but at the same time, it is an RV thing because RV is about the outdoors and adventures. And it's all about getting big stuff into a compact space. Yep. That is amazing. So, so is there anything different or special that you're doing? So what's unique to ours is that we use the same technology that's in a paddle board. It's called a drop stitch construction. Okay. We have it in the floor and we also have it in the sides. You may find another inflatable kayak that might have it in the floor, but you will not find it in the sides or it's very rare to find it in the sides. Got it. And so, you can tell that when you feel it, the material. If you guys can walk on a tightrope, don't look at JLF Adventures. But if you can't walk on a tightrope, which is everybody for the most part, uh, this is really awesome. You know there's going to be comments here, I can walk on a tightrope. <laughs> <laughs> and then, is there cool. anything different with like weight capacity too because of that? So our kayaks are going to be very buoyant. They're going to sit high in the water. So the water line is going to be down at the bottom. Whereas okay. most inflatables, they're going to sink low yeah. in the water. So what is the weight capacity? Stable, you can stand up in it. Wow. Okay. So we're very conservative in our weight capacity. This two person kayak would hold 2000 pounds before it would be Holy submerged. smokes. We rate it at a 450 though, just okay. because we, the way that we market our products is that they're very buoyant, sit high in the water. Yeah. So the more weight you put in it, the more it's going to depress in the water. Right. Got it, it. would hold a lot more than the 450. Got it. See, I love that because I have a bigger husband and he struggles with a lot of kayaks. You know, so even like some of the two person inflatable ones he struggles with. So that's awesome. Nice. Well, thank you so much. And how do people find you? So if you go to our website, jlfadventures.com. Perfect. Or, or pick one up at the Hershey Show. Thank you. Another awesome app is Spot Tonight. And I want to let everybody know this is not a spot, it's not a sponsored app, but these are just some great people. And with me is Gary. Tell everybody who Spot Tonight is. Yeah, so we're a centralized uh, booking website for campgrounds and RV parks. Uh, so pretty easy and simplified way to book a campground. Uh, you create an RV profile with us. And uh, when you do a search, uh, it, it takes all of that information into consideration and shows you campgrounds that uh, meet your specific requirements and you can book right through us. Wow, I love that. So it's kind of like an Expedia or a Hotwire book for RVs? Exactly. Yep. And you started, correct me if I'm wrong, you started off as like a last minute place yep. and now you're just like a normal booking place, right? Yeah, so the idea was kind of born out of the necessity to find a place like tonight. But, tonight? Uh, yeah. Like, but, you, uh, like, like it's almost like you needed a spot tonight. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we're, we're seeing more and more people booking, uh, you know, their, their their future plans with us. So booking pretty far in advance. This is what Will and I need because we like book things last minute. Yes, yes. So thank you so much. How do people find you guys? Uh, Spottonight.com. You can download the app or visit the website. Perfect. All right, guys, now we are over at Mantis Micro Cruiser. And it's, I, I saw it just walking by and it really caught my eye because it's a collapsible golf cart. So I'm here with Ron from the company and he's here to kind of tell you about the product, how it's different from your typical golf cart. So what you're looking at is you're looking at a golf cart that has a smaller footprint, but it has a lot of different attributes. So this golf cart is a 48 volt, 2000 watt motor with a solar panel on the roof, which will maintain the charge. So you charge it 100%, you're driving this all day today, it will maintain it at 100%. This golf cart will uh, shrink down to fit into a short bed pickup truck nice. or a large SUV. So when we shrink it down, this is what you're looking at. You're simply picking out the floor, taking off the roof, which is very easy with thumb screws. And this is what you're gonna look at. It's, that's where your floor would come out. At this point, you push it together. You put the pin back in, you're down to 60 inches. You can put it in your car. It comes with 16 inch tires. It comes with a wider turning base. It comes with turn signals front and back. Oh, nice. Headlights, horn, two sets of brakes, drum brakes, and uh, electric brakes. They're available in lithium battery. And they're also available in the traditional lead acid battery. Cool. 
I see this for like your uh, smaller trap, like either someone who has maybe a travel trailer toy hauler that doesn't have a lot of a garage space. That or a short bed. Yeah, or it's, someone who's towing a, a travel trailer and has a bed available. Absolutely. Yeah. I actually towed my, I actually loaded mine into my Jeep Grand Cherokee. Wow. Nice. Because what you can do is you can flip the seat upside down, you lift the seat out, you unscrew this, you lay it down, your highest point is 28 inches. Very cool. Well, thank you That's so much cool. for Brian, for showing the product. And if you guys are looking for a smaller golf cart alter alternative, make sure you come by and check them out. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thanks. Next up is Jeremy from the RV Atlas. How are you? Good. Great to see you, Matt. Thank great, you. Great to be seen. You know, super excited. We were talking earlier and you're going to get me on your podcast. Tell me about that. It's the RV Atlas podcast. It's a weekly talk show about RVing, and we're about to hit our 10th anniversary of podcasting. Wow. I'm excited to have you on. Make sure you guys check it out. And so who is RV Atlas? So we're authors. We write a lot of books. It's a series of books called Where Should We Camp Next? This is the first one. It's Where Should We Camp Next? Over 300 campground reviews in all 50 states. We've wow. sold over 100,000 copies of that book. Of, of a book? Yes, of this book. People still buy books, Matt. Okay. No, but like that's a lot of books. It's a lot of books. For books, Holy that's smokes. a lot of books. So when you for, for anything, that's a lot of yeah. anything. And when you sell a lot of books, you get to write another one. So Dang. we did our sequel, which is Where Should We Camp Next? National Parks. Okay. And these are our favorite campgrounds, both inside the national parks and in the gateway communities around the national parks, if you want your full hookups. Wow. And your pools and your amenities. Then we have Where Should We Camp Next? Camping 101. This is sort of like an introduction to getting into RVing. Okay. Buying your first RV, renting an RV, going on your first RV trip, et cetera, et cetera. And then we're back to the bestseller, where should we camp next? What do you mean? Same like book. Same, oh, okay, same, same book, book same book. Yeah, I got very, one of those very cool. Very cool. Bestseller, yeah. And These they're are available on Amazon. You can get them at Barnes and Noble or I'm here at the Hershey RV show. Well, we'll definitely link them down on Amazon. And believe it or not, I, I didn't know any of this. So that's actually really amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any other books in the future? Yes, actually. So talk to me, talk thank to you me. Thank you so much for asking. So where should we camp next? Budget camping. My okay. wife and I finished it about a month ago. Okay. You can pre-order it on Amazon right now. Let me see, let me see. That's Just actually like that. a QR code. Just like that. And um, But it will come out April 2nd. Wow. So that is going to be the next where should we camp and, next. And who's going to want that book? So this has got a lot of state parks, a lot of national forests, and a lot of Army Corps of Engineers. If you're camping on a budget, these are the best affordable campgrounds in the country. I love that. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank I can't you, wait to be, be on your yeah, show. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, man. All right, and next up is this cold, older looking motorhome. Because the RV Motorhome Hall of Fame's here. So that is very cool to see. I always like seeing, I, I love going to the Motorhome Hall of Fame. It's really cool to see these older RVs. Hello. And then they are next to electric e-bike. And I don't see anybody here. It is the end of the day. But you guys know we love our electric bike. And they're giving away a free bike. So if you want to win that, just scan that QR code. Very, very nice. Enter to win. Guys, those were just a few of the parts and accessories uh, here at the Hershey RV show. If you're not in the market for an RV, there is hundreds of vendors. That's why you see 75,000 people come to the RV show every year. Cause even if you're not buying an RV, it's just such an awesome place to see some of this awesome stuff. Again, I will link sponsors or non-sponsors down below. So you guys can, if you saw something you liked, you can get access to it. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next year at the Tampa RV show with awesome vendors they have.